thousand dollars. They, they, he said he'll accept it. He'll accept it for a thousand bucks, man. Holy uh, shit! Can yeah. I drive it to his house and give it to him now? Oh my god, you're the man. You're going to get the best damn review on the planet. You'd I mean, hell, even if they came back and doubled it, I wouldn't care, right? Like whatever. <laughs> <laughs> right? Like, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Yeah, yeah. So it should be good. And then well, once I say that too, because yesterday was ruined because I flew in for work and I went to rent a car. They would not rent me a car, and I said, "What the? What do you mean you won't rent me a car?" And he said, "You have a lien." I said, what? All right. So this client came to me originally in early of 2021 and he had tax debt going back to 2016. So it was about like five years that he had been living with this monkey on his back before he even came to me. Then come to find out he hadn't filed tax returns for several years because he went exempt from withholding taxes on his paychecks. So we had to file those missing returns. Once everything shook out, he owed over $127,000 to the IRS. Massive monster on his back now. Well, I took him through my normal offer analysis consultation to see, you know, did he qualify for this offer before we went ahead with the steps here? And indeed he did. And well, the rest is history. We got $127,000 of tax debt settled for $1,000. And uh, here's the phone clip of... Me letting him know after I had just recently found out from the IRS that they did accept the offer of $1,000. Enjoy. Hey, Anthony. How's it going? How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing good, man. Well, um, let's see here. I got some good news, man. Your voice when you're happy. Good you're news. Happy and non judgmental. You make me so happy. <laughs> we got some good, know, good stuff here, Chris. I just got off the phone with the examiner from the IRS thousand dollars they, they he said he'll accept it he'll accept it for a thousand bucks man so holy shit can yeah. i drive it to his house and give it to him now <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah oh my god you're the man you're gonna get the best damn review on the planet yeah yeah well thank you um, i have a relationship with you now no it's like you're you're so awesome and i actually have someone in texas who wants to use you but i don't know if you do people out of state yeah, I mean, I work with the IRS. This and his is... situation isn't as bad as mine. So, okay, good. So I'll, <laughs> nice. I'll hook you up with him. He's a nice guy. He just, you know, shit happens. Okay, cool. So, yeah. <laughs> Tell me what to do, man. Yeah, this so, so cool. next steps are, <sighs> um, unfortunately, we still need to wait a little bit. We're not free and clear just yet. It needs to go to a management for approval, um, and they have, like, 30 days to approve these things. So we're probably going to get a letter within the next, like, two months that says this thing got approved. I mean, is that a typical thing? Like, it's not, like, something to worry over? It's yeah, they, yeah worry over, we should be fine with this okay. because um, what happened here is that this case was with uh, originally with, like, I would say a lower-level examiner, um, and then they saw that, oh, you know, he's got self-employment income, so it went to, like, a little bit higher level of an examiner that's doing this. Sure. Um, and since this guy kind of approved it, I don't think there should be any issues with management. Um, but they, you know, crossed their okay. T's, dot their I's, so the management will make sure that he didn't I mean, mess hell, up. even if they came back and doubled it, I wouldn't care. Right, like whatever. <laughs> right, like yeah, yeah. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Yeah, yeah. So it should be good. And then well, once I say that too, because yesterday was ruined because I flew in for work and I went to rent a car. They would not rent me a car, and I said, "What? The, what do you mean you won't rent me a car?" And he said, "You have a lien." I said, "What?" And of course, my my heart dropped because I thought it was new. But it popped up from 2019. Right. I was like, what? Yeah. Now, why are you worried about it? Right, <laughs> like, right. Yeah, yeah. So, so as far as that stuff goes, once we settle, does that stuff go away or is it like? Yeah, it's, I mean, it all takes, I mean, as you found out this, all this time, stuff I'm takes sure. time to shake out, you know? Sure. So we're probably going to get a, sure. a letter within the next like two months. Once we get that letter. Um, it'll say like, you know, you got to pay your bill, essentially the thousand dollars, the, whatever sure. the balance is on that. Um, we pay that ASAP. Once we pay that, we'll get another letter saying, okay, you have, um, you've met the terms of the offer. Okay. And then at that point, then they're going to start the process of clearing out the liens. That'll take about another month or two. So if we, yeah, I'm in no rush. I yeah. Make sure that was part of it. Yeah. It's definitely part of it. Okay. Um, also Wait. part of it, and I probably said this to you, but I'm just going to regurgitate here. In the next five years, you got to be a good boy. Okay. Uh, be good. Okay. Okay. <laughs> and I'm going to hire you to do the bookkeeping. And, and, and you will be happy. I paid my taxes on the 15th of June as awesome. you requested. Awesome. Um, so everything was done, lit to the letter. So you give me instructions. I can follow it. So, Deal. 
Oh, yeah. I'm so happy. You are yeah. the man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I love I'm, you. I'm so- <laughs> uh, okay. I love it. Uh, I'm so, stoked for you. Your email and then um, the letter, does that come to you, to me? Just It's going to come to both of us. So we'll both get a copy of this. Okay, cool. Uh, but if I get okay, it before cool. you, I'll let you know. If you get it, whenever you get it, just let me know. Okay, you might get it before me. Okay, that happens great. a lot, actually. Um, so, yeah, okay. if you get it before me, let me know. And then, I mean, it's it's pretty clear on the letter on how to, like, respond to this stuff. The only thing I ask is because I do not want to miss their payment window. I just want to make sure that whenever that thing is, like, ready to pay, that I get it paid. I don't, you know, I don't want it to be a, an issue with not receiving a letter or something. You know what I mean? So right. As long as we're both supposed to get a copy, one of us will go. Yeah. And we do have five months from okay, the date cool. that you get the letter to make the payment. So it's not like it's like right I'm away. I will pay it within five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. <laughs> awesome. Around. Awesome. Awesome. All right. Cool. All right, buddy. Thanks for the good news. I needed that. Of course. All right. You have a good weekend. Okay. All right. All right. Bu- buddy, you too. All right thank so you. All right. Of course. All right. Bye-bye.